test. Well, more than 20,000 people are facing hunger here in Mesa County, and nearly half of School District 51 students are eligible for free or reduced lunch. Adrian Thomas has more explaining on how one organization in Grand Junction is tackling this issue. Members of Colorado's Blueprint in Hunger visited Kids Aid in Grand Junction today. Blueprint is a statewide organization aimed at fighting hunger, and the group visited Kids Aid to learn more about their work. The intent of the Blueprint is really to bring together partners that are working in this space. There's a lot of great work happening, and I think Grand Junction is one perfect example of the collaborative nature of kind of this work is going to require all of us to be working together. With about 150 volunteers, Kids Aid is aimed at making sure students don't go hungry on the weekends. We come in and we provide a bag of food to help get kids through lunch on Friday to breakfast at school on Monday mornings. Around 50% of students in District 51 qualify for free and reduced lunches, so organizations like Kids Aid are a big help to these students and their families. We try to target um, those children or anyone that's in a financial situation where they might need temporary help to help get them through, whether they've got medical bills or um, have been laid off from a job or whatever their situation is. Aaron Ulrich is particularly impressed with how Kids Aid delivers food to high school students through a food pantry system and hopes to bring more of Kids Aid ideas elsewhere. You know, no high school kid wants to get a bag of food in front of their friends. Um, and so thinking about creative ways to do that food delivery um, and in conjunction with their school liaisons and partners, I think is just a really great model for how we can operate other programs across the state. First on the Western Slope, Adrian Thomas, KREX 5 News.